Welcome to the Jones Zone. I'm going to try to make this one a quick one. Look guys, for those of you who keep asking me to flex, I want you to know that I'm not a bodybuilder anymore. Alright? And um, honestly, let's just say quite frankly, I am not interested, you know what I'm saying, showing my body so a bunch of middle-aged dudes who are pretending to be girls can get off on my body. Alright? That's that's over with. You know what I mean? You guys got that off and was, you know, going in there and catfishing and you know and, and, and masquerading as girls and all that kind of stuff. And I had to figure things out the hard way. I had to figure out, you know, how uh social media works, how YouTube, you know, uh works. And uh, you know, after going through that for a little while, I got the game down. Some dirty stuff that y'all doing. The ones that were just pretending and everything like that. And y'all gay and shit like that. Like, for real. So that's why I'm asking y'all to go ahead and just unsubscribe if you just can't handle the new content. If you can't keep up, you know what I mean, with this new pace that I'm kind of rolling out here. Okay, now think about that if it were the other way around. Let's say that the subject is an insecure uh, girl or insecure teenage girls and stuff like that. Four, 14, 15, 16, twerking. You know, on a, on a YouTube video wearing some skimpy stuff. And then there are men aged 20 to 50 in there making sexually explicit comments. You know how soon YouTube would shut that down and there would probably be some kind of investigation going for all the men, you know, that were doing shit like that, that were involved in those uh, uh, illegal activities, questionably illegal activities, because technically you're not having sex with these girls, but you're watching them and under a sexual uh, context of some kind is what you're doing. You know what I mean? But when it happens to guys, guys are the subject. It's like, oh no, they're, they're teenage boys and stuff like that. And then there's a little bit of a, like I told you, a complication, you know, with the, it being a bodybuilder activity. You know what I'm saying? So there's some cushion there, room, if you will. There's some room there and stuff like that. But still, you know, that doesn't change the fact that you've got people in there who are watching that content all for the purpose of getting off. You know what I'm saying? And that's, it's, it's happening. This is a very real thing that's going on probably right now. And it just makes me wonder, why the fuck won't you go to just some other, like, uh, go to a gay porn site or something like that? You know what I mean? Oh, because they can't have 15 and the 15 and 16 year olds aren't going to be on the porn sites. They're on YouTube, though. Show, at least showing their upper body. And maybe some legs for some of them. Oh. Now tell me, that kind of thinking. All right. How is that not predatory? How is that not predatory thinking? And how, if you are a person living in society, an educated person who is gay, living in society, how can you not know right from wrong when it comes to something like this? And then presume to talk shit about somebody else, what they're doing. You know what I'm saying? And critiquing someone else when you've got this fucking dark ass cloud hovering over you. This predilection that you have. Seriously. That's why I'm allowing that, that silence for a moment. Just for you to think about that. And you ain't even got to think about it. I know many of you are going to run from it. But all I said, I've said all that I really needed to say about it. Just to get it into your mind. You know, to have you, all I want you to do is to, is to reflect on it. That's all I'd like you to do. Reflect on that and why it is that y'all are doing shit like that. Oh, yeah, and I uh, currently have 340 subscribers. So in the event that uh, that number falls down to like 200 and something, the difference in that number will represent the amount of uh, people who got exposed for, you know, messing with the, uh, the minors and shit. And for all the guys who are talking about semen retention and they want the girls to, you know, come on the page and, you know, uh, you know, and all this kind of stuff. Man, there ain't no girls coming on the uh, on your page and stuff like that. I'm going to be honest with you. A very small percent of girls are watching dudes that are flexing and stuff like that and everything. And if you think it's a girl that's doing it, chances are it's a dude. You know what I'm saying? Women are not sitting here getting off on big old buff dudes, uh, you know, flexing for like 10 minutes and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? They're not getting off, if you know what I mean. Men are getting off, if you know what I'm saying to you. If girls will watch, it's interesting to see muscles and stuff like that, but they're not going to be overly fascinated, not to the extent that a, that a man is. And unfortunately, in this day, uh, you know, that's that's not happening. 
you know what I'm saying, on no YouTube, you know, you know, that listen to you, you talk about some interesting stuff, you know what I mean, uh, what it means if you're a guy telling a girl what to do, and you come across as a genuine guy, and this is, you know, telling them that, oh, this is what go other guys like, they will listen to stuff like that, but they're not going to sit there and uh, willing to go crazy over some muscles like that, it's not, okay, I'm just, just letting you know if you haven't figured out the game already.